بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ابھی ہم سٹارٹ الوان تو رابعہ فورت یونٹ الحیات الیومیہ ڈیلی لائف الحیات من لائف الیومیہ ڈیلی ڈیلی لائف الوحدت الرابعہ الحیات الیومیہ الدس السامن وشرون ٹونٹی ایت لسن الارد Presentation Al-Hewarul Awwal First Dialogue Unzur Vastame Waid Look and Listen and Repeat Tariq Mata Tazdai Kizu Tariq Ask Mata When Tazdai Kizu You Wake Up Ta Mean You Tazdai Kizu You Wake Up Tahir استعی کزو اند الفجر I wake up at فجر استعی کزو I wake up تستعی کزو you wake up and تستعی کزو is for male only اند ایٹ فجر فجر پیر تورک اینا تسلل فجر where do you pray the فجر صلح تاہر اُسَلِّلْ فَجْرَ فِي الْمَنْجِدِ I pray the fajr in the mosque or masjid. تَارِكْ هَلْ تَنَامُ بَعْدَ السَّلَةِ Do you sleep after the salah? تَارِكْ لَا لَا أَنَامُ بَعْدَ السَّلَةِ No, I don't sleep. After the Salah. So whenever we have Hal in the question, we must use either La or Naam in the answer. Whenever we have a question with Hal, we must use Naam or La in the answer. Tariq, Ma za tafalu ba'da Salah. What do you do? after the salah so here you might notice that after the word bada next word i is a next word always have a kasra so remember after the word bada next word always have a kasra but bada is not preposition okay but it gives kasra to the next word tahir akra ul quran i read the holy quran Tariq, wa mata tazhabu ila al-madrasa? And when do you go to the school? Tahir, azhabu sa'at tasabi'ah. I go at 7 o'clock. So anything which represent the action, or which represent the time of action, always have a fatta. So that's why sa'ah has fatta. Because it is telling us about the time of the verb. Hal tazhabu bisayyara? Do you go by car? So B is also a preposition, so it will give kasra to the next word. Tahir la azhabu bilha filati. No, I go by bus. So now I need to ladies who will read and translate this. Just raise your hand. Kinza, you are Tariq, and Doctor Rizwana, you are Tahir. Start it. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Mata tasai kizu. When do you sleep? When? when do you wake up? Right. Okay. I wake up at Fajr. Aina to Salil Fajr. Where do you go to the Fajr? Where do you? Where do you pray the Fajr? Go to the Fajr. Where do you pray the Fajr? Where do you pray the Fajr? Salil Fajr. I pray Fajr in the Masjid. 
ہل تنام باد سلا وٹ ڈو یو ڈو آفٹر دا پریئر نو نو تنام یو سلیپ ڈو یو سلیپ آفٹر دا سلا اوکے ڈو یو سلیپ آفٹر دا سلا اسکول Can everyone hear me? Okay. Yes. Okay, now if anyone has any questions, she can ask me. Does anyone has any question? No. Just unmute and... Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum as salam. سوری <laughs> I actually I didn't understand your question but let me repeat the sentence aina mean where to salli mean you pray al fajra fajr salah where do you pray the fajr salah so if you are asking why fajr has fatha then the answer is fajr has fatha because it is showing us it is uh, telling us the time of verb that's why it has fatha with it So I did not understand your question, but whatever I understood from you, I just answered it. So if anyone else has a question, she can ask me. Assalamu alaikum, teacher. Wa alaikum assalam. Can you read that again? Okay, your name please. Amin Abdi Hassan. Okay, Amin Abdi Hassan. Okay, two sisters will read and translate it. And then anyone who wants to read and translate just raise her hand <clears throat> miss tahseen you are tariq and miss khatija you are tahir start okay mata tastaiqizu astai when did you wake up when do you wake up it is a oh, when do you wake daily. up okay when do you As wake up I stay I stay in in the fajr I wake up um in fajr Okay Aina to salli al-fajr where do you pray fajr the fajr O salli O sal O sal lil fajr fi masjidi fi masjidi I pray fajr in the masjid in the, in the mosque Hal tanamu ba'd as-salati? Do you sleep after the prayer? La, la, la anna, la anamu ba'd ba'd as-fajr, ba'd as-salat. No, no, I don't sleep after prayer. Maza taf'alu ba'd as-salati? What do you do after salat? Aqra'u Qur'an. 
ومتى ومتى تذهب إلى المدرسة and when do you go to the مدرسة school أذهب أذهب ساعة ساعة سابعة I go um, at seven o'clock هل تذهب بالسيارة do you go by car لا أذهب بالحافلات uh, no, I go by bus. No, anyone, if any question? I think no question. What is the verb of tastaikal? Astaikizu. So you want to ask the past? What is the verb? Of? Okay. Istaikaza mean he woke up. Istaikastu, I woke up. So it's present is. The only way. Sorry, what? The word wake. Wake. So the root word, the root verb is always fail mazi. Okay. The root verb is always fail mazi. So its root verb is istai kaza. Istai kaza mean he woke up. So this is the root verb of this verb. Okay. This is astai kizu. And that is istai kaza. And if you want to ask the master, then it then it is istai cause. So we have not started master yet, but okay. Good question. If you want to ask master, if you are asking about master root word which is an ism, not a verb, then it, it is istai cause. Then Al Wahdatu Rabia, Al Hayatu Yomia, Adasu Samin, Warishun, Al Mufradat. So, anyone who wants to read and tell me the meaning of these Mufradat, just raise our hand. Someone is asking the plural of Sayarat, its plural is Sayarat. So, Mr. Tassin, you will read and tell me the meaning of these words also. Mr. Tassin, unmute yourself. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, Yanamu, he is sleeping. Yes, Taikizu, he is waking up. Yazhabu, he is going. Sayaratu car, hafilatu bus, madrasatu school. Now you have used Dhamma with Sayara, hafila, madrasa. Either use Tanween with the ism or either use nothing. You can say Sayara oh. or you can say Sayaratun. Hafila, oh, okay. hafilatun, madrasa, madrasatun. Okay. Sayaratun, hafilatun, madrasatun. Now we have question. Tadrib Ajibanil Asil Asilate Bhiktizar answered the questions in brief. So these questions are your homework. I will just tell you the answer of one. Iktisar means brief or Iktisar is brief? Yes, Iktisar means brief. So my yastai kizu in the fajr who wakes up in the at the fajr time. So let's you can use any name, but let's we say Tariq. Tariq, yes, take is in the fajr. You write the answer here and upload the answers to Google Classroom. Okay. Then the last three questions are for yourself. Mata tastaikizina anti. Or you can just write it directly. So here you write uh, the answer according to your daily routine. Then again. In the last three questions, you will write the answer according to your daily routine. Okay. Any question? No question. So we'll proceed to the next one. Al Hivaru Sani Al Um, the mother. Haza Yomul Utla. This is holiday. Al Ab. Haza Yomul Amal. 
this is working day or this is the day of work so basically the father wants to say that today we will not sit idle but today we will do the house chores al um the mother maza sataf alu ya tarik sa min will tafalu you do what will you do o tarik so sa min will what will you do o tarik tarik replies sa akunu su ghurfatal julus i will sweep the living room i will sweep the living room so now she will ask a question to the female first you learn the question for male that is tafalu tasdik izu taktubu takrau in case of female we had ya noon at the end wa maza sataf alina ya fatima what will you do o fatima note the difference between male and female saaknu su ghurfatan naum i will sweep the bedroom al um wa maza satafalu ya ahmad what will you do o ahmad ahmad saaghsilu al malabis i will sweep or oh, sorry i will wash i will wash the clothes al um the mother wa maza satafalina ya latifa what will you do o latifa latifa saqwil malabis i will iron the clothes so in all these sentences in these sentences you will note that the object of the sentence has fata which i already told you that object of the sentence has fata like malabis urfa urfa so all these are objects of the sentence al jadda the grandmother ana saqsil al atbaq i will wash the plates al jaddu wa ana saqra al quran and i will read the holy quran so you also know that they uh, the mother did not ask the elders of the family to do any work they themselves choose their work so no i need to sisters who will read and translate it raise your hand miss satia you are al um and miss abdi you are al ab Hasa Yomil Utla. Miss Abdi, unmute yourself. Miss Abdi Hasan, Amin Abdi Hasan. I think she is not available. I need someone else. Chor ni kare, me sabak karenge. Assalamu alaikum Anna. Miss Salma, do you want to read this? Yes, yes, Ms. sir. Salma, you are Al Ab. Start it. Anna Al Um. You are Al Ab. Miss Satya is Al Um. Sahih. So Miss Satya, read the start again. Haza Yamil Utla. الاب هذا يوم العمل you need to translate it also okay this is the holiday الاب هذا يوم العمل this is a working day ما ستف الو يا طارق what will you do طارق ساقنس غرفة الجلوس I will sweep uh, the living room. Wa mata sataf alina ya Fatima. 
And what will you do, Fatima? Sa'aknusu ghurfatan naumi, I will see the living room. Bedroom. Ghurfatan naum, bedroom. Okay, ghurfatan naumi, bedroom. Bamaza shatak alu ya Ahmad. And what will you do, Ahmad? Sa'aksilul malabisa. I will wash the clothes. Wamata Sataf Alina Ya Latifa. And what will you do, Latifa? Saakwil Malabisa. I will iron the clothes. Ana Saakfilul. At the bar. Ana Saakfilul. At the barka. I will wash the plate. Wa ana sa akra ul Qurana, and I will recite the Holy Quran. Okay, so al jadda means grandmother and al jadd grandfather. Any question from anyone? I think no question, so we can proceed. Al Mufradat vocabulary. Mr. Rama, you can read the vocabulary and translate it. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Yaumul Amal. Day of work. Work day or working day. Working day, working day. Yaumul Musla. Um, all this, all this. At bar, at bar, please. Yes, no, see. Um, he's sweeping. He sweeps, okay. He sweeps. Mala. So, Mufradat. Mufradat means vocabulary. Mala. Okay. Malabis clothes. Yag Miss Yag Silu washing. Okay, Yag Silu is washing. Yag me is iron. Okay, he's iron. Now, if anyone has any questions, she can ask. Tadrib. Ajibanila Silati Bhiktisar answer the questions in brief. So here the question is May Yak Silul Malabis. Who will wash the clothes? So let's say Ahmad wash the clothes. So I will say Ahmad Yak Silul Malabis. So you write the answers here and upload the answers to Google Classroom. And those students who will not do their homework, I will remove them one by one. I, uh, I have already removed many students from the group who are not doing their homework. I will remove the others also. Then, al wahdatul Rabia, al hayatul Yomiya, Daily Life, Ad-Dasu Salasun, 30th Lesson, al hiwaru Salis, 3rd Dialogue. Okay, Miss Kinza is asking me to translate the question. Okay, if anyone wants to translate the question, just raise her hand. Miss Bainisa Makoti, unmute yourself and read the questions and translate them. Okay, okay. I will. So, number one, Maniago Silul Malabis, who will wash it? Clothes number two, man and sayak nusu gurfatal julus who will who will sweep the um who will sweep the living room number three, man sayak ora ul Quran who will recite the Holy Quran number four, man sayak nusu gurfatan nau who will sweep the bedroom number five, man sayak usil akbar who will 
who will wash the dishes or plates. Number six, man sayak will malabis, who will iron the clothes. Number uh, seven, kam afadul usra, uh, how much? Uh, how many ano? members of the family? Uh, how many are the members of family? Okay. I don't know that and you translate it. Okay. Come mean how? A flag uh, people how of many? Al -usra, family. How many are the people of the family or number of the family? Okay. Uh, sorry, pardon? This can you have, can you hear me? I can't. Okay, no, come no. Flag al -usra, how many are uh, the number uh, how many are the members again? of the family how many are the members of the family so next we have man whom who are they <coughs> man whom who are they mata hazal hewaru when did this dialogue take place mata hazal hewaru when this this when did this dialogue take place so this dialogue take place on holiday or Sunday, you can say, or holiday. So if anyone has any questions, she can ask me now. I have, I have two questions, Astad. Yes. One, there is a sa on the verb. So I wanted to ask about that. And the other with come, you said that the, the, the word that comes after come, is has a it's mufrad and has a fatha I'm, I'm i don't remember you had so explained something about come okay got it so you have two question first question is about the sa sa mean will okay sa mean will so this sa uh, that we um, write at the start of the verb or any word mean will it is used to convert a word meaning into future okay to specify the meaning of the word or verb in future time okay uh, uh, what's the difference between sa and sofa no difference which all no uh, difference. okay absolutely same thing just different spelling no difference okay thank you um next second question that she asked me that after the word come i said the word must have two qualities that it should be singular and it should have fatha at the end but the word here afrad does not have these two qualities it is a plural word and it sorry what i have written here it and it sorry singular and fat ha so the word afrad does not have do these two things it is a plural word and it has dhamma so the, she's asking why we are not following that rule here the answer is this that the word the and the original word here is missing we have deleted the original word which is adad so the word here after the come is adad ada dan so we have not written that word here because it is understood in speech anything which is understood in speech we don't use it in spoken arabic so let's say i ask you what is your name? So you will not say my name is Tehseen Khan. You will just say Tehseen. So you have uh, deleted many words like my name is. You have deleted three words in your answer. So same thing here. When anything is understood, they just delete it. So original question is come other than. Okay. Then again, of course, when we use other, we need to change the question according to it. That is not our topic at the moment so just remember the original word here is deleted that's why afraad 
there is no effect of come on afrad okay yes just just at the end why you come anyone else miss kinza is saying please turn this the question sentence eight again so question eight man whom man whom mean man mean who whom mean them who are they so we'll translate the question like this who are they so you just need to write the names of all the family members here like tariq fatima latifa father mother grandfather grandmother you will write their names here anyone else i think no question so we can proceed now we'll take a break and after the break we will probably start sahi bukhari or if i had time then we will read a dialogue also so inshallah see you after 5 minutes ma salama ma salama jazakallah ma salama